Did you forget your password? Don't worry, we've got you covered with these three simple ways that you can get it reset. First method is the Easy View app method. This is going to be the easiest way to do it, assuming that you used an email address when you set up your recorder. You're going to click Forgot Password, and you're going to see a QR code. Next, you're going to get out your phone and open the Easy View app. Once you have that open, we're going to hit the three lines at the top to open the menu, and then hit where it says Me, followed by the General button. At this point, you're going to scroll to the bottom of the screen. You'll see Forgot Device Password. Click that, and then hit OK to allow it to use your camera and scan the QR code. It will send it automatically to the email address that you have on file. So what we're going to do is go on to our email, find that code, and put it in. Okay, here you go. You can see I've got the security code. I'm going to go ahead and copy this code. And then I'm going to paste it into the security code field under the QR code that we saw earlier. Once I do this, I click Next, and then I will get a password prompt to allow me to change my password. It's simple as that. After you've picked a password that you want to use, enter it into both security fields. It needs to be the same password on both fields. After that, hit OK, and now your password has been successfully updated. Go ahead and do a quick check here just to show that the new password is functioning. So I'm going to enter in the new password, hit Log In, and there we go. Got a video feed from the camera using the updated password. The next method is the reset switch method. This will factory default your camera and allow you to log in with the default password. In order to get started, you have to find out if your camera has a reset switch. If it does, go ahead and locate that switch. Usually you'll be behind some sort of hatch or access port, or if it's a vandal dome, it's gonna be under the dome on the main board. Once you have access to the switch, we'll move on to the next step. Now that we have the access hatch removed on our sample camera, we need to push the reset switch for at least 15 seconds. So find a small object that you can reach the switch with and press and hold for 15 seconds. Once you've held it down for 15 seconds, the camera will go through the reboot procedure. Go ahead and let the camera reset. And then after that, log into the camera using the default password of 123456. If none of those systems work for you, don't worry. Univue's tech team is able to help you still. Go into Easy Tools and find the serial number of the device that you are trying to reset. You can find it by going into the device details and you will see it listed here. Once you have the serial number saved and potentially also the date and time if you're doing an NVR, uh, you can call Univue's tech support team, give them this information and they will give you a temporary ID that you can use to log in. Once again, thank you for watching. We really appreciate it, and it would be great if you could subscribe to the channel. See you guys later.